So today I want to talk about the mindset that will actually help you succeed in the age of AI. What I'm seeing is as like I am I passed out from college in 2024 and it's 2025 and in the last one and a half year of working as a full-time software engineer I have seen a lot of changes so let's go back to 2022 when I was doing a Twitter internship the whole process was very manual software engineers had to code they had to test they had to build they had to deploy they had to handle everything about the infrastructure as well then in 2023 I did a Google internship and during my internship again the whole process was so manual and the project that I had worked on was actually a testing framework that I was building. So I was actually going ahead and building an integration testing framework for one of the components. That was my two months project. So just imagine my whole project was around testing. And then during, even during my Intuit internship, which was a six month internship, the whole process was very manual. I was going ahead and creating front end dashboards. And then I was connecting with Kafka. I was doing a little bit on the back end side as well. But now if I look back and I see all the tasks that I did, I think AI could do that in lesser time and in a better way. So this has really made me realize what is the future for software engineers? What is the future for us devs? And I have realized one thing which the current AI models are not really good at, which is which the current AI models are cannot really do. And that is innovative thinking, innovative mindset. But now you might be wondering, OK, I know innovative mindset and innovative thinking is one thing. But how do I actually learn it? What does that mean? There is one principle that I want you to learn is it's the first principles mindset thinking. Let me tell you what that is. First principles mindset thinking is all about breaking something down into such basic terms that you know it yourself, right? So let's say, for example, a few days back, I was explaining something to my mom around AI or something like that. And then she just broke it down into something so simple. Like, let's say if she has to cook something, right? And she's like, I have to tell you guys the instructions and then you can go ahead and cook but but you guys cannot do it yourself and she said that the current AI models are like that like you have to go ahead and prompt them and then they will go ahead and do the task but they cannot do that task on their own and that right there is the exact example of using the first principles mindset thinking that you break something down into such such basic terms that you understand it totally and thoroughly. And now I'll tell you why that is the most important tech skill that you can have right now, or not just tech, what, why that is the most important mindset and the skill that you can develop. It has been used by everyone. Elon Musk used it to learn about SpaceX and learn about why building rockets was very costly. He broke it down, he understood all, he questioned every assumption that the industry had, and then he tried to break it down and then he simplified it and figured out, okay, what is that model? How about we build it? from scratch how about once you break something down into such simple terms you really can build something from the ground up and why it's really important with ai so ai amplifies your idea not assumptions so even if you look into the current ai models and everything what you'll see is that whatever you are telling it it will either agree with you or it will amplify you or hype you about that but it will not go ahead and challenge your assumptions it will not tell you what is really wrong with your approach so if you have the thinking skill where you question the status quo, where you question the assumptions which have been made, you will be someone that people are looking to work with. In today's time, if you really want to innovate something, you want to build something, you really need to have the mindset where you question everything. You try to understand that, okay, if something was done this way, why was it done that way? And what would happen if this was not true? So having a questioning mindset is something that will really make you succeed in today's time. The number three is that AI generated slop is the same, right? If you create something using AI, to be honest, people can tell that it was generated using AI. Even for, let's say when I'm posting something or some, I try to write the post on my own, whether it's on Instagram, whether it's on LinkedIn, because I know that if I use AI to go ahead and do that, people will come to know. And it, even though I know it takes me longer to do that, it still creates the personal connect and the fact that I'm still writing to you. I am still putting in my effort to go ahead and write to you. So that is very important. And one thing that you should do is that you should have the first principle mindset and try to do everything on your own first as well. That way you will still try to use your own brain, try to use your own thinking and mindset and not just default to chat GPT. The number four thing that I would like to say is that you can build anything faster if you understand the fundamentals. So I have been recently building something with white coding and I've been trying to build an app and the hell it's so tough to do that. There are so many steps, there are so many issues that you run into. But the fact that I'm a software engineer and the fact that I have 
I have very strong fundamentals and even though I have not built an app before, this process is becoming a lot easier for me than it would be for someone who did not know about the fundamentals or anything. So that I think is a very important thing that you need to understand everything in such fundamental terms that even if you go ahead and use these AI tools in the future, if something breaks, you know exactly what to fix. And those are the people that will actually survive in the long term, not the people who are just going ahead and vibe coding randomly without understanding how things are working. I'll be honest, I, if right now, if you're still building a project by coding, that is a waste of time for sure. But yes, understanding how things are working is a very important skill that you should have. So having a first principle mindset, I would say in today's time is the most important thing that you can do, develop for yourself. And how you can do is that start doing it right now with every project that you're working on with everything that you're working on any new concept that you're learning try to question every assumption and try to understand really break down everything into really simple terms skills can be sold knowledge is abundant so what is it that we can do so we have to be the innovators then we have to go ahead and build something of our own that is our superpower and today is to be honest, really the best time to become a founder or to go ahead and start something of your own. But that can only be done if you really understand the fundamentals. And I hope you like this video. Let me know in the comments if you did not understand something about first principles thinking or what is it something that you are worried about or anything. I'll see you in my next one. Until then, bye bye.